Hello everyone, this is Jacinta from Posture Tonic. Welcome. We have a back, shoulder and arm focused Pilates workout today. So make your way down onto your belly. We're going to zip up your core, gentle squeeze through the glutes, reach your arms down by your hips. And then we're hovering our chest slightly off the floor, rotating at your palms. So ready to go in two in one. Inhale, squeeze the shoulders together, hover your breastbone off the floor a few inches and then turn your palm down towards the floor and up to the sky. Really focusing on that squeeze through the upper back and reaching your fingertips as long as you can towards your toes. 30 seconds to go. Last five seconds on this one. Keep that squeeze and lower the chest down. Arms sweep out to create a letter T, palms facing down onto the floor, moving into our back extension with those arms reaching wide to the sides of the room. To advance, you might like to lift those legs off the floor here as well. Let's begin. Inhale, lift, exhale, lower. As you lift here, your core is tight. We're squeezing through the back and pointing and reaching out through those toes. Squeeze the legs as well, make it full body. 30 seconds. Halfway, keep your eyes focused down on the floor so your chin is tucking in. Great work, last five seconds here. Then we're flipping on our back, getting ready for our abs. Last one and lower. We roll on over, ready for our curl with a single leg extension. So neutral spine, elbows are wide, hands are interlaced behind your head. You're gonna exhale, curl up, extend one leg and then inhale, lower the chest back down. Let's go, exhale, curl up, reach one leg. Inhale, rest the head back down. I want you to really focus at the top here. Can you hold for one or two seconds as you point and reach that leg so your abs get a little bit of a shake? Five seconds remaining. We're then flipping on our bellies and it's back time in two in one. Roll on over. Extend those arms overhead. We have those abs zipped in, the glutes squeeze once again. And then this time we're lengthening the arms forward as we hover the chest off. We find that squeeze through the back once again. Let's go. Inhale, hover the chest up, reach the arms and exhale, slowly melting down that breastbone. So you keep your eyes on the floor chin tucked in and it's that squeeze through the back and gentle lower down so equal work on the way up and controlled on the way down Five seconds remaining. Can we lift a little bit higher, keeping that control and lower. Rest here, 15 seconds. We are gonna challenge ourselves with our swimming. So we'll maintain that back extension as we kick our arms and legs in our position. Ready to go in two, one. Let's go, inhale, lift and exhale, kick, kick, kick. So breathing at your own pace, and I want you just to hover only a few inches. It's more about length on this one, as if I'm pulling your hand and someone else is pulling your legs. We're really stretching, lengthening our spine. You just take rest whenever you need, and then reset, lift up again. You're doing so well. Can we stay up for the last 10 seconds? 
Maybe lifting that chest a little bit more, kicking a little bit more vigorously. Last three, two, and one. Well done. You get to roll on over here now. We'll focus on those abs. Give the back a rest. This time we'll be curling up and holding, moving into our toe taps. So you wanna keep the knee flexed at the same angle as you tap your toe down. Ready? Let's go. Exhale, curl up, hold. Tap and tap. So changing those legs, staying in that curl. Endurance-based exercise for that core here now. Stay focused, 30 seconds. So good. Feel those abs right to the end. Control for the last four, three, two, and one. Well done. Staying there, just walking your feet out hip distance, fingertips facing your feet. We'll be then moving into our reverse tabletop to elephant. So exhale, tuck the hips under, lift up, stretch open those hip flexors, and then take your hips, swing them back through when you're ready. Take it up, squeeze the glutes at the top, and then control as you sweep the hips underneath you using your arm strength now. So booty at the top, back muscles, shoulders, and then it's abs as you round your spine and lift yourself up off the floor. On your next one, see if you can tuck the hips under a little bit more, reach that tailbone long towards your feet as we open up and find that stretch. And release, awesome work so far. Let's come to a kneeling, it's a hover. So hips hovered away from your heels and then hinging forward so you have a ski slope spine, palms face down as we circle the arms from hips to overhead. Let's begin. So inhale, sweep the arms up and then exhale, drag your shoulders down your back creating that resistance in your own body. So squeeze the arms, the shoulders, reach long through the fingertips. Abs scooping away from your quads. Last couple here. Give me one more. And then come into a half plank, preparing for our staggered tricep push-ups. So elbows pin in tight towards the side of your body. We're gonna lower down for three. So down, down, down all the way, and then push all the way up. Three counts down, one count up. Let's begin. Inhale, down, 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 and then exhale up. Three, two, one, press all the way up, keeping your abs tight and the glutes on. Great work. Try it for your last couple of reps to get your chest all the way down to the floor if you haven't yet. We have five seconds. Your last one is here. And push all the way up. Awesome work. Our last exercise, we're laying down on our belly, focusing on lengthening out through the arms and legs as we lift our chest up and circle your arms towards your hips, squeezing down your back. Ready to go. In two, in one, inhale, lift, sweep the arms towards your hips and then exhale, control yourself back down as you swing the arms back overhead. Trying to lift your chest up high and lift those thighs off the floor now as well.
Keep going, your final 10 seconds here, and then we'll finish with a beautiful child's pose in five seconds. Last one, and melt all the way down. Push yourself back, hips over your heels as you reach your arms forward, enjoying a nice child's pose here, bringing that breath down, breathing into the back of the ribs, and then when you're ready, you can come all the way up. You guys completed your 10 minute back, shoulders and abs workout. Well done. Make sure that you're subscribed so I can keep on giving you these free workouts. Like the video and I will see you back here for our next workout really soon.